Hello, this is a quick overview of the renin angiotensin aldosterone system. This system is important for regulating blood pressure. In this example, we're going to have a decreased blood pressure. When the kidney detects a decrease in blood pressure, it'll release an enzyme called renin. Renin will interact with angiotensinogen, which comes from the liver, and it will convert angiotensinogen into angiotensin 1. The next step is angiotensin 1 will interact with ACE, which is angiotensin converting enzyme. This occurs in the lungs, and angiotensin 1 will be converted to angiotensin 2. Angiotensin 2 has an effect on the arterioles and is able to cause vasoconstriction. This in itself increases the blood pressure. However, angiotensin 2 also goes to the adrenal cortex to stimulate the release of more aldosterone. Aldosterone is a hormone that acts on the kidney. It tells the kidney to retain more sodium. So when sodium is retained back into the blood, water follows sodium and you have an increase in the blood volume. With an increase in blood volume, you're going to have an ultimate increase in the blood pressure. This was a quick overview of the RAAS system, and I hope this helps you. Thank you.